Did you know that poor hooding or no hooding can be a major problem for your ventilation system? Hi, I'm Luis Castaño, one of IAC's engineers, and today I want to share the tip of the month focused on hooding design. You may not give it a whole lot of thought to the hoods, but hoods are an important component in your vent system. To illustrate that, let's look at this belt-to-belt -belt conveyor transfer. This is a very typical problem in, in a lot of plants. You got a transfer and some dust generation. Your vent system should keep this in, in, in negative pressure so that dust doesn't come out and just say that this is properly designed. If you pull the design airflow from this vent point, you're going to have some velocities here of air coming in. Well, if these velocities are still significant where the material is being conveyed, you're going to pull dust into the vent system and that's really not the purpose of your system. You're supposed to keep this, this enclosure under negative pressure, but you should not be pulling material in. And this is where hooding comes in. Just picture the, the improvement that we can get by installing a good hood, which looks something like this, to minimize the velocity coming in and still keep the volume that is required for this thing to work properly. So hoods are an important component. Some of the systems out there that we see in the field don't even have hoods or have poor hooding. So the operator chokes the vent system to avoid pulling too much material, which defeats its purpose. So just something for you to think about uh, on this tip of the month on ways to get the most out of your system. If you would like to discuss this subject in more detail, call one of our sales engineers. Thank you.